Broadcasting live from Lavile Stadium in San Francisco, home of the 40 Nightmares. You know why this team is named that? Because their fans are known to wake up in a cold sweat screaming at the top of their lungs. <laughs> I don't blame them. Don't poke fun at their city, Grim. Plenty of great places to eat if you like vegan. Hey, I love to eat vegans, but they always whine when you're cooking them. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The Malice Hellboys take on the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, no game, no bad kill. Get on, get on, get on, get on, get on, get on. Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones. Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nutsack was shrinking, and I sprouted this mini me on my shoulder. Bricks Jr., freak me out. You're a pussy. And it's first and ten. It's a glitterception! What's that, Grim? A f oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object! If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. Is that right, Grim? That penalty makes no sense! Hey, something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. <laughs> And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And another interception. This quarter. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. <laughs> and it's first and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Boom, and he's dead. with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Just slipped away like a greased pig. <laughs> Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite him. They're back up here on first down, and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref.
First down in a mile. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, and that's what it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice trim. It'll be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. With the brain scrambler. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just you just throw it to the guy in the same color and he scores. Nobody can touch you with an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, you from my house. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. This is your brain, and this is your brain on berserker drugs. Is that, is that guy brain getting... Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Second down and ten. And the defense goes for the jugular and rushes to... And the whistle blows to play dead, along with the quarterback. Yeah! And it's first and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't always throw interceptions, but when I do, and he's off to the races. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Boom, and he's dead. Wow, oh, bingo, 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 I got bingo, Grim. <laughs> hey, man, I was going to hit him now. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak! He's unstoppable! Second down in a very lot. And that's 
That's another pin. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. Catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down and nine. down and well good luck I don't know if he even had a target on that throw I hope some lucky fan gets to cast the ball this is gonna be a great kick with how hard he's gonna have to kick it he'd probably die bricks there's me the binoculars it looked like the QB's fault if he held the ball spikes out like it was supposed to the kicker would And it's first and ten. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. He's at the third. He's running out of gas now. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch? Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. And this game is up for grabs. First and two. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Second down and long. Oh, Mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. It's a little... He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And it's first.
First and ten. The defender says, I don't think so. Second down and ten. Oh, man, he really wants it. Oh, big catch, big run, big touchdown. Yeah, big deal. Missed a beat for Bray Graham with a ball and didn't fall out. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. First down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Defense ball, one speed, and a defensive pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Third down, and the punter is warming up. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Shave a few days off his life. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Man, guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. First down and five. He picks up a two. Second and three. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. Yeah, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. Hot two, hot three. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And they run it for a couple of yards. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up at the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. No matter how many years in the league, I gotta tell you, this don't get any less scary. Oh. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Second down and more than the QB would like. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Two, three. And he just wrestles away. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning.
The third quarter is about to begin, and if it's as much of a blowout as the first half was, we may see a riot in the stands. Well, that's going to happen either way, Grim. It's a $1 Red Bull clap and vodka jello shot day. Oh, <laughs> The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. Second down in a lot. The quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to lay waste to the defense. Hey, that defender just got And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Graham. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Third down and long. Stuffed at the line of scrimmage. And he's going to have to boot this one halfway to hell. I thought he was going to make it. Yeah, so did his coach. Someone get that shotgun away from him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. I Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. This guy's a brick should have. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. The 10. He is fighting for every yard. And that is caught for a first down. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. Yeah. First and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just, and he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Hey. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And he breaks away. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's what it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> he picks up eight yards on that pass.
third down and six. And the defense gives up five yards there. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. The return man catches the ball and heads up. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Hot. one. Hot. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this outfit. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps on sides and attacks the QB. It's not how many times you fall. It's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. Yeah, an eight ball wouldn't hurt either. Did somebody say cocaine? The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Other uh, than the few little expenses, that is. First and two. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed feed grip. He's running from his team, it's clear. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The onside kick's the desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. Usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? He's off to the races. The first. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Eight. Man, what a hit that was. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, eight. Oh man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Second and three. Cannonball, first down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. He broke. 
free and has open field in front of him. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell here. It might be time to change the channel. I think Heidi's playing on Superstation WKRP. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you mark. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Third down and five. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. He's at the 40. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Does the QB know which team he's on? Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And the quarterback throws another pick. Oh, with the punishing hit. Yo, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Second down in a lot. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And another interception. This quarterback is gonna. Oh man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you could... hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned MFL rule. <laughs> And that'll bring up second and... Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Grim, what a finish up. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep.
And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Second down in a very lot. Hot one. They go to water speed dirty trick. He's so fast he watches 60 minutes and 60 seconds. Third down and, well, good luck. Hot one. Hot two. Hot two. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Oh, no good. Now that punter's going to find a cutoff. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we? At this point, with multiple inter... That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one, eight. Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. Third and four. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Bam! Oh, man, that's the end of his day. Try hurling those traps next time. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> the offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Watch it! First and eight to go. Oh, that was brutal. Some of his entrails are in the stands. That'll make a great souvenir for the kids. Hey, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, you from my life. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kick off into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really the ref that just called that penalty. He was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. That sounds like a good job. He's right at home here, taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swiping money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that?
And it's first and ten. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? Because I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. You have got to be kidding me. My sister could have made that kick. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. First and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't always throw interceptions, but when I do, it's when the game is on the line. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The defense lost another line basher on that play, and only two remain on their roster. Their defense is getting very close to forfeiting this game. And it's first and ten. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. Listen, he could go all the way. He's at the 30, and he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the... Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot! That's why we love the MFL! Uh, why are they stopping the clock for the offense, Grim? They're stopping it for their own offense. They're hungry for the ball, partner. The ball? The pigskin? Bacon! I'm hungry for bacon! He refuses to go down. Nicely done for a first down. And the D takes their second time out, hoping for a miracle. I witnessed a miracle once. A player was brought back from the dead. That's not a miracle, partner. That's just how the MFL works. Offense, Bricks. That's that's the important part. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Third down and the punter is warming up. Scrambler. The offense is running low on receivers. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And yeah, for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And they'll line up for the field goal. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. <laughs> Ballsy. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Hopefully the next guy learns or we're going to have a pile of dead refs. Any field goals over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. 
The kick is good. Um, as expected, those are pretty much just... San Francisco 40 Nightmares have won the game in front of their hometown fans. And the stadium is screaming like a kid's party at Chuck E. Cheesy. After a stomping like that, the opposition may be a permanent part of the field. Oh, like a graveyard, Grim. There are body parts everywhere. And speaking of body parts, that I ever tell well, you about... Well, let's listen to MVP. I'm sure he has something inspiring to say. Hey, man. You see that? That's right. You can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitro with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.